Hello and welcome to another video from Retro Leisure Midlands Limited. Today we're going to show you how to add music to eTouch uh, free, free box music player. To start off we're going to click the options icon. That's the one with the hammer and the spanner. On your jukebox this is probably full screen, it depends how you've got it set up. We're going to click power off, that will take us back to the Windows operating system. We're going to go to my computer, we're going to go to C drive, MP3. This is where the music is stored. We're now going to insert, in my case, a USB stick or a USB hard drive, uh, where, whatever your music is stored on. Back to my computer. We're going to click on it with our left click. If there's more than one folder, we press and hold down the corner, look, do that, or we can go edit, select all, and then go edit, copy. We're going to go to the music folder. We're going to right click. We're going to go paste, or you can go edit, paste. Now that that's done, we're going to close this. We're going to close this. We're going to close this. We're then going to go to configuration. We're going to make sure that says MP3. We can now see now five has appeared there. Generate image thumbs. And in each of your folders, when you add music, if I go to five, you'll see there is a folder here called cover JPEG. That gives the jukebox the images Let's generate library. The more music you have, the longer it will take. Complete, no errors. So we bit generate a library, then okay. Then we're gonna click that. We go back into Freebox by launching it here. And now we can see we've got now five. Thank you for watching. 